One of the hardest things to get down in Mortal Kombat 1 is the Garrus clone combos. And this user totally agrees. Says, how do you use the Garrus clone? I've been trying to combo with it, but I just don't know how. And you are not alone, my friend. Many people do not know how to use it, especially effectively in combos. I'll break it down for you. One, how to actually use it. Back, forward, three, enhance. Creates this clone and has this kind of like a time stop period. During that grayscale time stop period, any inputs you do, once that's done, the clone will do those inputs, allowing you, Garrus Prime, to do any anything you want to do. So Gears has a forward four, that is a low. You can just press forward four during this, make the clone do the low, and then you go for the overhead. First, that makes for some insanely hard to block mix, and to use it in combos is even harder, but it can look like this. So you see there technically wasn't a very true combo. They had periods where they could have blocked, but it's just super hard to block because you go for the low, you might go for the overhead. You might make the clone go for the overhead, you go for the low. No one's really expecting it. And it can really throw them off their guard. Now keep in mind that does use two bars though. So if you're gonna use that clone move, definitely make sure you know how to make it worth it. Otherwise you're gonna waste two bars and that's just a big disadvantage you don't wanna be at. But I would definitely mess around with that clone a lot more. Figure out what you can make the clone do while you do something else. Garrus, in my opinion, is by far one of the most fun characters to learn and use in Mortal Kombat 1. He's gonna take a lot of labbing, but damn, he's worth it. Hope that helps, and subscribe here for more.